bringing fast charging to the home and in a second phase into public fast charging will really create an infrastructure that makes a huge difference. With this project, electric mobility will take a quantum step in the largest automotive market in the world. We expect China to take a leading role globally in the rollout of e-mobility. The volume in China, with the, the immense uh, uh, political power and government support behind it, because of the pollution in China, they are creating a volume that is mind-boggling over the next decade. This volume will drive the prices down and will drive manufacturing, and that is why China, as a market, will be the volume generator for the rest of the world, if the rest of the world doesn't speed up as quickly as China is doing. It is very important. It is actually indispensable for our customers. It is a significant leap for a sustainable mobility in the Chinese automotive industry. So what we need is an accessible and a usable charging solution. And we believe that ABB is able to provide this. ABB will not only provide this charging ability, also will provide a installation and later on the after-sale service. So the customer has installed this inside his house. Using this wall box, the user can use the interface on the charger itself, but the charger is also connected to the cloud. That means that the cloud enables applications like on your mobile phone to activate and to stop a charger remotely. The decision to go in this market a couple of years ago was the right decision and there's tremendous potential in the future with a fast ac acceleration of penetration. Electric mobility, especially when combined with renewable power generation, is a key contributor to a sustainable environment in the future. ABB has decided to play a lead role in this field. We are throughout the entire value chain with our renewable energy uh, generation, with the very efficient power transport, and with the usage now in fields like e-mobility, we are contributing significantly to that environment.